Hey everybody, Josh here from Android Central, and I just wanted to show you guys uh, something called SVox Classic Text to Speech Engine. Uh, for any of you who absolutely despise the stock robot voice that does text to speech, uh, you'll hear it in things like Iris if you've played with that, or Navigation, especially if you use the voice. Uh, it's really, really outdated, and in light of Siri coming out, uh, really reveals how how clunky that sounds. So I've got the SVox app right here, and it's got uh, 40 plus voices in 25 plus languages. So you can just, you know, pick your poison. But I speak U.S. English, and so there's five voices you can pick from. Uh, you can listen to a sample, get a free trial for each voice, or buy it. So that's Grace, obviously a huge step up for the normal female voice in Android. And I also bought Michael, uh, which is the normal male voice, which doesn't sound quite as good, but I still wanted to show off some examples with it anyways. Come on. Uh, so those are the two I got. Uh, Dark Lord and Ghost are purely comical. And Benny is, if I haven't bought this one, if you want uh, your voice to sound like a chipmunk, uh, I imagine Benny is a five-year-old child or something who just inhaled a balloon full of helium. So that's how Benny sounds. Now this is just the actual SVox Classic Text-to-Speech app. There's also apps specifically for the voice packs that you buy. And so you can set things like the device volume, the text-to-speech volume, speed, and pitch. And then you can also listen to it speak some phrases. So I saved a couple of phrases. Whoops. Sorry about that. And I would say yes. And then uh, this one is actually fairly fluent. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if the woodchuck could chuck wood? So that's very, very cool. Uh, you can also, I'll hop into Michael now. And let's open up the same phrases. What's up, Android Central? Isn't this voice so much better than the stock one? So still pretty good. Uh, not quite as soothing as the female voice, but still gets the job done and then probably the coolest thing is here uh, you can put a pronunciation correction uh, Michael doesn't do it very well but Munoz. my last name is Munoz so Munoz. he says it Munoz but I think I fixed it on Grace Munoz. Munoz. well close enough uh, but it's better than Munaz, for example. So if you have a name that's difficult to pronounce, um, then you can correct it like that by spelling it out phonetically. Now, the way you're going to change this is in the rarely used voice input and output. If you go into text-to-speech settings, you can, let's see, default engine, you're going to pick SVox Classic Text-to-Speech. And then you'll have to have already installed voice data for one of these voices. And you should be good to go if you go into the text-to-speech settings. Here's where you can pick your voice. So I've chosen Grace. And now if you go into something, I'll just demonstrate on Iris. Um, what day is today? So there you go. It's Wednesday, the day of the week. Iris is obviously not very functional, but this is about the SVox text-to-speech and Grace and Michael voices. So that is how you can definitely get a better text-to-speech engine for your phone, how to change it, and uh, how to find the voices that you're after. The SVox Classic text-to-speech engine is free by itself, 
but I'm not sure if I mentioned this before, each voice pack is $2.99. For me, it's well worth the money. Uh, so it's a couple apps, SVox Classic Text-to-Speech, and then the voice packs, SVox US English, Grace, Michael, Benny, Dark Lord, and Ghost. You can find them all in the Android market.